All right, in this video, what we're gonna take a look at is how to connect your Gravity form to ActiveCampaign so you can actually start getting people into your list. Okay, so what we're gonna do is go to Forms and then Add-ons. So assume you've got Gravity Forms installed and you've got an active license. So Forms, Add-ons, and then Active Campaign should be the first one. All right, there it is. So I'm just gonna click on Install. And then we'll click on Activate. All right, so the plugin's activated there. So now we're gonna go back to the forms and then we're gonna go back to our main form, our opt-in form. And then go over to settings and then active campaign. Okay, so now we wanna configure the active campaign settings. All right, so here we need the API URL and the API key. Now you can find that within your Active Campaign account. So logging in, you go to your account and then my settings, and then you go to developer, and then you can see we've got the API access here. So I'm gonna copy that. And paste that in, and then I'll click on update settings. All right, so we've got the green tick, which is excellent. So now we'll go to forms and then back to active campaign. All right, so now we can create a new feed. Okay, so I'm just gonna name that the name of the opt-in, which is just name. Uh, and you'd rename that with the, the name of the lead magnet. So then we'll choose our list and we'll go to the funnel shop here. All right, so now that's gonna pull in the data from ActiveCampaign so we can match it up. All right, so we've got email address, so we have to do that one. So email and then first name is first name, which is fantastic. Okay, so we're not gonna put any tags on them. We're just gonna leave that as is and then we are going to leave that, those settings exactly as they are. All right, so we're just gonna click on update settings there. Alrighty, so that's looking pretty good. So now what we wanna do is go back to the landing page and then you want to add your email address. Now make sure you add a new email address there and in, insert that and submit the form and make sure you check in your active campaign list and make sure that that email has come in. All right, so that's how you connect ActiveCampaign to Gravity Form so you can start collecting those email addresses.